To create a new page or article in Joomla, go to Content, Article Manager. From within Article Manager, on the top right hand corner, click New. When creating a new article, you need to insert some fields before adding content. You need to give your page or article a title. We'll call ours Example. You don't necessarily need to fill in an alias, as this will be generated when we attach the article to a menu item. Organisation is very important when maintaining a website and placing your articles and pages within a section and a category will help with good organisation. Also, when using more complicated extensions that pull information from different parts of your website, sections and categories are often what the extension uses to distinguish what information should be taken from where, so it's a worthwhile habit to get into. Change published to yes if you would like the article to be live immediately. You also have the option of making that page the front page of your website. We'll choose no in this example. Further below is what's called a WYSIWYG editor. This is where all content editing is done. For more information on this, see both WYSIWYG editing in Magento and WYSIWYG editing in Joomla. Another section that needs to be completed when creating an article in Joomla is the parameters. You can change these parameters to change things like publishing an article's author, for example. The meta information section is very important for search engine optimization, as it is where you write your meta description and meta keywords. See more videos in the series on search engine optimization for help with what to write here. The final step in article creation is to save by clicking on the save button in the top right hand corner. The next step is to link your article to a menu item. This is how visitors of your website will find your article. You do this by going to menus and clicking on the menu section you'd like to add your article to. We'll choose example pages. Within the menu item manager, click new in the top right hand corner. A new menu item has been created. First you need to choose a type. We'll choose article. In the article area, you can hover over each different article type to get a short description of it. We'll choose article layout. Within the article layout, you need to fill in some information about the new menu edition. The first is title. This should be similar to what the article title is. This is where you fill in the alias. The alias refers to what comes after your website's address in the address bar and is used for search engine optimization. Now you choose which menu you want the article to appear in. We want ours in the Example Pages menu. Published should be set to Yes if you want the article to appear on your website straight away. The phrase on click open in simply refers to what you want to happen when someone clicks on the article's menu item. Do you want it to open in the same browser window, in a new browser window, or in a new browser window as a pop-up style? with no browser navigation. In the top right hand corner is the basic parameters. Here we add the article we just created by clicking select and a list of our articles pops up. We want to choose example as that's what we called our article. Click the article to select it. Our article has now been added. There is also component parameters and system parameters you can alter for differing results. Once you're happy with your menu settings, you can click Save.